Hello everyone, it's Janelle and today's tutorial is for glass nails. I tried out nail stickers from Korea for the first two looks. And the last look is completely DIY with iridescent tissue paper. To do my buy or DIY test, I bought these two sticker sets from Korea on eBay and I spent $5 each on them, including shipping. Unfortunately, I found out it only comes with one sheet each. And for the DIY glass nails look, I bought some iridescent cellophane from Party City for exactly $3.25 after taxes. For look number one, I'm pairing my glass nail shards with two sheer coats of blue. Sheer iridescent shades are especially pretty with the glass nails effect, so bust out the sheer polishes that you rarely use for this look. Upon first using this, the stickers I bought from Korea are freaking tiny and impossible to peel off with fingers, so I took off the excess sticker first. To peel off the tiny stickers, I stuck a piece of tape over half of each sticker to pick them up. I then grabbed some pointy tweezers, picked them up, and put them on the nail. So my strategy for placement was to leave small gaps in between each triangle, and it was a puzzle trying to fit as many triangles as I could. Then to seal in the stickers, I applied some top coat. Here is look number one with triangles and baby blue underneath. Super pretty, very time consuming. The second set of stickers has an amazing cut gemstone pattern and I paired them with two layers of sheer pink this time. To grab the stickers, I used the same method as last time. I tried my best to mimic the same gemstone shape and I did a pretty good job, but this took forever and a day to do each nail. Again, apply top coat, but with pre-cut stickers or cellophane, make sure to add enough layers of top coat so that the shapes aren't prone to peeling off. Well, even though sticker peeling and placement is super duper tedious, the end result is stunning. Unfortunately, I had to remove it to try out a DIY version coming up next. To make DIY glass nails yourself, cut teeny tiny shards and triangles of iridescent cellophane or tissue paper. The smaller the better because bigger pieces won't lay flat on your nails and will have a higher probability of peeling off during your everyday life activities. For the last look, I chose a super dark blue nail polish that's almost black to increase contrast. Since these are not stickers, apply a layer of base coat so they can stick in place. This time I picked up each little triangle with an eyeliner pencil and I arranged each piece with as little overlap as possible. The original creator of this look used gel polish in Korea to encapsulate the cellophane because big pieces like these are very easily peeled off if any ends are sticking out. So make sure you add as many layers of top coat as you can stand if you want this to last more than a few days. The cellophane that I bought looks pink over lighter colors and green over darker colors, so this dark polish really brings out the green. So out of the three different glass nails looks, which one is your favorite? Let me know in the comments below. I gotta say though that the DIY look is much cheaper and it's much faster to do, but it may have less staying power. Just don't forget the top coat! That's it for this video! Thanks for watching! Hey! Did, did they click like? If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up! Cause we have no thumbs! <laughs> please subscribe! Bye!